Hello and welcome to another Raggy's Beer Review. So, the final um, beer from the Lakes Bruco slash Bruiser um, subscription box, discovery box for May. Uh, we're now in June. So, this is Leave No Trace. It's described as a 3.4% table beer. Got to be honest, not a fan of table beers. And I'm not a fan of 3.4%. But we'll give it a go. We'll see how it cooks. Um, here it goes. Leave no traces embracing the true ethics of our region. Our namesake, the outdoors code and one to live by. This is part of our ethos and lifestyle we like. Adopt an easy drinking, perfectly hot, light beer that is bursting with citrus and tropical notes. Perfect for those days on the fells or thereafter. Take it easy wherever you may be. Hops are Brew One, Strata, Citra, Cryo, Strata, CGX. And obviously brewed by the um, Lakes Bruco in Kendall in the Lake District. So there you go. So at the end, um, it's been interesting. There's been some cracking beers. There's not been one, not been one beer I wouldn't drink again. Um... Possibly the weakest of the beers, certainly ABV wise, for obvious reasons. Um, a light, hazy, yeah, uh, a bit of sporadic carbonation, a bit of a white head going off, a straw, hazy straw colour pour. Good aroma on it though. Um, yeah, I mean, if you didn't know the. Um, the ABV before, and you wouldn't know that, that this was below 4% on the aroma. So, you know, there, there's a thing. As, as someone who's not a fan at all of these 3.4 percenters, I get what the crack is. I don't care for the crack. Um, I was at the pub today. Fantastic brewery. Uh, a craft New England IPA. Six pound ten a pint, and it was three point four percent. And I'm like, I'm not paying six pound ten a pint for a three point four percenter. Um, I know the brewery, and six pound ten for a three point four percent. No, not a chance. Not when the duty on it is literally half the duty. To pay six pound ten, um. I felt that, that that was a kick, kick where it, you know, it should be kicking. And um, no, I'm not going to name the brewery. I mean, I got this in the Discovery Pack, literally paid like 20 quid for eight beers. You can get £10 off for your first Discovery Pack, which I think is a good idea. Um, you know, 20 quid, whether you get it this month or in future months, if you've never had one before. I'll put the code in the description if you're interested. Um, it's a good idea. However, you know, going to a pub and paying £6.10 for a pint of 3.4 is slightly... Um, I'm not going to do. No. If it was on cask, I'd expect to be paying £3.30. Uh, and for craft to be £6.10, wow. Not a chance. No way. Orange and lemon came bursting through there. Um, yeah, good citrus and tropical notes coming through this. Um, we all have our boundaries with beer drinking. Um... And, um, yeah, there are certain styles of beer that I don't care for. And and then there are certain ABVs that I don't care for. And uh, I'm not really keen on low alcohol beers. You know, they serve a purpose for certain people. They do not serve a purpose for me. I'm not interested. Um, the lower ABV beers, are, a.k.a. table beer slash duty beers, like this beer. Don't really care for. Yeah. 
um, and especially when when there's a premium price on it. So where I was in the pub today, uh, this particular brewery, a Nottingham-based brewery, so it's literally a couple of miles away from the brewery, from the pub where I was in, uh, two or three miles probably at the most, uh, and. Um, so I have it on at six pounds ten on keg, when there are six point eight percenters at the same price. Oh, now we're talking, you know? No, absolutely bloody not. I'll bring this up in a bit with Raggy, and I, 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 I'll, um, I'll see the responses to it. Um, I'm very interested to see, you know, the general perception of it. Um, I get breweries are doing what they do, you know, and I, I get the three point four percent. But when they're as expensive to us as 4%, 5%, and it's like, well, why am I paying that? The duty's not, there's not much duty on it. So, you know, there's some good clear profit there to be made. And at £6.10 a pint, there's a lot of profit. Um, yeah. So, it's a good tasting beer, despite the ABV, which I don't agree with, you know, I don't agree with it, it's as simple as that. Uh, who am I? No one. Just someone who does a, bit, a few beer reviews in Nottingham, but uh, I've got an opinion, and uh, I'm allowed to have an opinion, as everybody, you know, out there who's got an opinion is allowed to have an opinion, and um, yeah, uh, I don't agree with it. It's as simple as that. Mm. <laughs> I just had a lovely um, chicken kebab as well. And the wife paid. Yay. I pay enough for bloody going out every Friday or Saturday and uh, paying for it all. So, yeah. So. It's interesting. Um, the last of the Lakes Brew Co beers, I've got to be honest, if it said it was 4%, I, um, I'd, 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 I'd have took that all day long. And I said, yeah, I agree. You know, it's got a good hoppy tropical citrus aroma. Same with the taste. You know, it just tastes like a nice beer. Uh, just not keen on the 3.4%. Simple as that. My my opinion for what that is. Cheers all. Um, would I drink it again? Not at that ABV. No. Simple as that. Um, out of five, if I was going to give it a score, a good 4.3 out of five. So yeah, it's a good beer. Just uh, not keen on the ABV. Cheers. <laughs>